Underground Nose Dance in Burnham in the UK. Now today we're going to be looking at the sequence dance, the rumba one, and we've adapted it to fit the smaller spaces. We're going to break it down to chunks for you and then we'll put it together as we go through the routine. So for this routine we're going to start with our rumba basic but we're going to rock back first. So leader's left foot, follower's right foot, we're going to have a rock, replace and side. Now leaders are going to put our left hand up, creating space for our part to step underneath. We're going to rock back on our right foot, and at the same time our part will step through the middle with the left foot. We're going to step. As you rock forward with leaders, the follower comes forward to their right foot, and we set the side to face each other, and we're going to take a two-handed hold. From this position, we're going to go into our shoulder-to-shoulder -shoulder movement. We're going to do three of these. Leaders on the left foot, followers on the right foot. Leaders, you need to step outside of your partner, and we're going to have a rock, replace, side, rock, replace, side, rock, replace, and side. Now at this point, leaders, we're going to create space for our partner to stop her from turning back to face us. We're going to lunge to the middle, what we call a fencing action. We're going to lunge and step to the side, and we're both going to step to the middle and turn around on the spot. It's going to be a step, turn around, and side to face our partner. Now for the moment, we're going to take our partner back in hold and go into a back rock, follow coming forward left foot, and step, rock. From this position, we're then ready to start all over again. So, lead a left foot, follow a right foot from the beginning, rock, replace, side arm up, follow a turns round, shoulder to shoulder, two, three, hold, two, three, hold, one more, two, three, our fencing, fence through the middle, spot turn, and back and hold, back face it. And then we're back to the beginning. So we're going to try that together with some music. A reminder with sequence dance that you have to wait four bars and then everyone starts together at the same time. Okay, so knee is left foot, follow is right foot, from the beginning. Let's see how we do. <laughs> So after this fencing, we step through and get ready. We're going to have our spot turn as normal. The step, turn around, and take a right hand to right hand hand shake hold. At this point, the leader's going to walk back on the right foot. Followers coming forward left foot. We've got three walks in quick, quick, slow. And leaders, we're going to turn a quarter of a turn anti-clockwise to our left. So I end up with my back to you. We have and quick, quick, slow. From here, we're now going to have three Cuban rocks. So we're going to have a rock, rock, step. Now, ordinarily, we do another three rumble walks and we go back to where we came from. We do this, quick, quick, slow. However, we're going to make this routine a little bit more simple for smaller spaces. We're going to do three steps straight in a straight line. We're going to have quick, quick, slow. From here, we're going to do two cucarachas which is a side step, leaders on their left foot, followers on their right foot. We have a quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. And for now, we'll go back into hold and start with a basic to start all over again. So our arm up, we turn our partner under, arms wide, shoulder to shoulders, rocking outside your partner, into our fencing, our rock and slow, we turn around and again, right hand hold leaders, three walks back, Curl into the face your next wall are three Cuban rocks. Now again here, depending on the space you've got, I'd recommend probably just footsteps on our walks forward at this point, leaders. So one, two, three. 
Okay, again, if you've got more space, you can walk with that, but you're probably actually hitting the sofa by this point now. We have our cooker arches, again, pushing out to the side, lead is left foot, follow right foot, out and come in, out, go back, back and hold, and then your back's the beginning from there. So we're going to dance all that now to music, and we're going to do it four times so we end up back where we started, hopefully. with the leader taking the following shadow hold before we do six rumble walks down the floor and a spot turn to go back to the beginning. However, as we've adapted the routine for smaller spaces, we're now going to have a compact chasse ending in shadow hold and then the leader is going to keep time on the spot while the follower walks around the outside. We'll show you what we mean. So we're going to start from our cooker archers. Leaders on the left foot, followers on the right foot. We have a quick quick, slow, a quick, quick, slow. At this point, we're going to take a two-handed hold. I'll just show you what that looks like, a two-handed hold. From here, we're going to do a compact chassis. Leaders are going to start with their left foot, followers are going to start with their right foot. As leaders are on the inside of the turn, they're going to take much smaller steps and we're going to end up in shadow hold. And we have a quick, quick, slow. And the easiest way leaders get to that shadow hold, we mentioned before about taking two hand, it's a cross hand hold, and all I do leaders is just gently pull my left hand up and place my right hand on my partner's back. Now from here again, normally we'd walk in a straight line together. What we're gonna do, however, is have our follower coming forward, we're gonna march on the spot, and quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. We'll both step forward and do a spot turn, quick, quick, slow, and we're going to go back to the beginning of the whole routine from there. Okay, so let's try that all together. Leaders on the left foot, followers on the right foot, and quick, quick, arm up, quick, quick, arm wide, shoulder to shoulder, two more, one more, then our fencing, quick, quick, spot turn, quick, Quick, slow, three walks, walk, 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 three rocks, rock, 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 three walks, one, two, three, kakaracha, one, take cross hand hold. From here we're now going to have our compact chasse, the new section that we've just been doing. 
compact chasse, six walks, three, four, five, six, spot turn, quick, quick, slow, and we're back to the beginning. Let's try that to some music. Shoulder shoulders. Into the fencing. And one turn around. Take your right hand and hold. Curve in our walks. Rock, rock, slow. Small, compact steps. And on cook, garage, cross hand hold. Compact chasse. Bring your partner around. On the spot. Turn back to the beginning. Rock arm up to the slope. Arms wide. Prepare. Rock and slow. Spot turn around. Right hand hold again. Curve in our walks. Rock, rock, slow. Feel for the gaze of me and adoringly in her eyes. Sensing. Right hand hold. One, two, three. Quick, quick, slow. One, two, three. Arches. Out and in. Chasse, going round on the spot, turn around. The eye as you keep going there, left one, until the end of your song. From there. So that was our rumble one sequence dance adapted for smaller spaces. We hope you enjoyed it. See you again soon. I'm Anthony. And I'm Emma. And we run Learn to Dance in Berlin in the UK. I'm Anthony. And I'm Emma. And we're Berlin. Yeah. <laughs> Emma doesn't want to be the centre of attention. No, never. <laughs> Anthony loves it. Lips on the. Quick! I'm close. <laughs> Your face. Mama walks. <laughs> now what we're going to do is break all the... Oh, sure. It's a nice one. At this point, leaders, we're going to put our left hand up in the air, so just to bounce our legs head up. Yeah. Not this one, Emma. Ah. <laughs>